Hello everybody, <laughs> we're on YouTube, <laughs> I don't want to get banned seeing as uh, school rose. <laughs> oh, no, fucking hell! <laughs> um, God, I don't want to get banned seeing as school rose just written something that without context could have looked pretty bad. Yeah, no, before that though, school rose, before that, um, it could have looked pretty bad. He was referencing us playing GTA the night before, but it could have looked bad to people who didn't know what it was. Right, up against uh, round three of TSD, Tackle Zone Star Divisions, against Justicium, who is, uh, to all accounts, very good. He, is, he has won both of his games. 1-0. Um, He's got three guards, a mighty blow, um, a block and a sure hand, chaffs. Um, I lost to... Uh, I lost to the Kenry, didn't I? And then I've got a standard... The standard team, so <sighs> yeah, maybe N wasn't the best word to, to just spam, letter to just spam, but I was just spamming something. I tried to spam a dot to get rid of it, and I couldn't spam a dot, so then I just moved my finger across the keyboard. So it should have been maybe better. Any, anything other than N was maybe a better, <laughs> a better letter to, <laughs> to spam, <laughs> but I didn't think about that, so. I just, uh, I just spammed a letter. I don't know how. All oh, right. <laughs> oh, fair enough, one <laughs> Oh God. Well, Villa Hoppier, <laughs> as you saw from bloody uh, what, what Johnny Five or after it, and um, that explains it really. Yeah, it's still short on screen. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, I, I timed out Skuro, but it still turned up on my screen. So, yeah. I just wanted it not to show up on the screen for the YouTube. Because if it were contextless, it would look pretty bad. <laughs> no, no, that bit wasn't so bad, Skuro. It was the first part. It was the first line that you said, but hello, I wasn't. I wasn't meaning to tell you. I was just literally to tidy up the screen. <sighs> yeah, that is like forcing poo, isn't it? Are we going to do an offset? Are we going to? Are we going to throw the offset in to confuse the new player? See, this is the thing, you can't really do it now because you can definitely target the catcher. Whereas if I go there, it's not so easy for him to target the catcher. So I'm not going to do an offset. Plus he's not a noob, so it wouldn't work anyway. Hope a big game with Shaw. <laughs> I hope for an absolute Dyson, to be honest, just as you... <laughs> Good. Um, Essex, I don't know what ex what Essex is, to be honest. I know it's a place in England. That's all I know. Thanks for the hose, Goliath. <sighs> Fucking hell. He's carrying on it, he's got sure hands, so he's got a strength four sure hands player to carry the ball against elves. Specifically took it again for the elf matchup. And then got drawn against one of the few elf teams. <laughs> Look a dog. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, there's a TV show, The Old New Ways Essex, and Van Outen's from Essex, Denise Van Outen, but from back in the day, if you're my age and British, you'll remember the big breakfast and how how uh, how amazing Denise Van Outen was on it. 
Um, she was from Essex, but I don't really know what the uh, I don't know what the stereotype is. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Glorious. Until I'm victorious, <laughs> and I will defend. I will defend. <laughs> Intellectually, you kind of know that 36 months being subbed is equal to three human years. <laughs> but hearing it spelled out in the gestation period of several random mammals really brings home how long it's actually been since I've done anything productive in M. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> what a message. What a message. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much for staying fantastic with three years or nine who will be the pregnancies. Thank you very much, Dr. Mon Bosco. Absolutely glorious. Thank you very much. Incredible. Incredible. Uh, <laughs> incredible message. Thank you very much. The hell is my age? Uh, I'm nearly 40. Oh, my mum. 39. And uh, yeah, no brain slugs. I only timed you off for like an hour or something just because you were, you were getting rowdy. So I timed you off for an hour so that... Uh, you wouldn't be rowdy anymore. <laughs> In toe years. <laughs> There's no such thing as toe years. Let's start with a 2D without block. Brilliant. <laughs> Why do I take the trees? Why do I even fucking bother? Why do I fucking bother? Honestly. Honestly. Why do I bother with a fucking tree? It's just literally the worst. Uh, it is, yes, Grimzilla, yeah, there's, uh, it's like Naf style, um, and there's like a round robin, there's a few round, like, there's about, there's about 64 people in it, I think, and I think there's eight, eight round robins, and then, uh, a cut to the top, cut to the top eight, he's not blitzing the wardens, so no, he's prioritising getting forward. Le ballon est en sécurité, à l'autre équipe de prouver le contraire. For some reason, he's got guard in the cage <laughs> with a strength for sure hands carrier. That's disappointing. I just wanted to get to hit his bloody, uh, you know, what, what are they called? Hobgoblin. Because obviously, Justician being a good player, he's not going to let me hit his Hobgoblins. But if I'd, uh, if I'd knocked over that guy with my tree, I would have been able to hit a Hobgoblin. Which would have been nice. Course. I can't remember the last time I fucking stood somebody up successfully. I just literally can't. <laughs> just come, just come. <laughs> Just come. <laughs> they were pretty well protected. This guy's next to a guard, and this guy that could only hit him if I based him up, got a guy served, <laughs> and then hit him on 2D. And the other guy's miles away. Oh, 
oh shit, there's his mighty blow guy. Oh god, that wasn't a good place for my war dancer, was it? <laughs> Righteous. <laughs> Righteous come. I mean, could have done, yeah, but I don't want to do that, do I? Si joueurs sont tout proches, le combat paraît inévitable. La vache! Ce joueur encaisse son manger! Oh! 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 Well, all right then, let's go. Oh no, that doesn't work, does it? I thought I could get a one. No, I can get a one day if I pa if I remove him. Now, if I'd removed him, I could have got a one D. <laughs> Yeah, I really needed to really needed to remove him there to get a one D at the ball. I mean, I know it was unlikely, but there was a chance, wasn't there? <laughs> Why do I bother with a tree, honestly? Fucking why? He's quite far forward. Do I get to do anything good here? I don't think so. Try to do something good. Don't know if this is going to work or not. I can try, can't I? See what happens. Didn't work. Maybe I should have just dodged everyone away. I can't be bothered. I should have tried to reschedule with him. To be honest, I should have just rescheduled. <sighs> I 
It was pretty stupid playing in this state. I literally just got out of bed and got on the computer, so <laughs> I'm not I can't think at all. <laughs> I have I have absolutely zero thinking capacity in the hardest game well, I say hardest game, best coach probably in in the group. You know, it's splitting hairs though, obviously, like it's not like he'd um even if he is the best, it's not like he's much better than uh Shawnee. And uh or Paul or whatever, do you know what I mean? Or me. Oh God, what's the, I, surely that only, surely that only works for like handsome people. Yeah, Amaranth did it. Fair enough. Works when it's a uh, works when it's a uh, hot young lady, doesn't it? Right, let's yolo it then. This way, yeah. <laughs> ah, ah, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Two, three. Oh god, he, this guy's a pin in the ass. Oh no, I can just GFI and get away. Three has one in nine, and then one in two, one in four, one in eight, one in sixteen, as he has failed to get up any single turn. Um, <laughs> I just yolo'd in J5. He was near. To be fair, it was his fault for for going two squares away. If he'd been three squares in, he'd be fine. But because he was two squares in, um, I had the three and eight chance of the ball, the crowd, and the ball. So really, um, even though he's going to get a double surf here, uh, I think that was a bit of a mistake by him. Like obviously, it was very lucky on my half, on my part. I'm not going to not going to deny that I was very lucky, but he also didn't get the surf because <laughs> he didn't fill in that square. That was careless of him, wasn't it? Maybe he's a bit tilted. No, I won't give See now that in. there is tilt, right? Till I'm victorious. See that that I play will there I will defend. is tilt. My beaver gave birth to twins. For all I you fucking twats. 
Thank you very much, Frost Lord Army, by the way. For all you twats who say, just when I'm ranting and raving that I'm tilting, that's not tilt. That there is tilt from him. Because he should have made that a double surf, right? He set it up to double surf. Didn't do the double surf. Because he was tilted. That's tilt. That's what tilt is. It's the actions. It's not the ranting and raving. Alright? <laughs> All fucking right? Um... <laughs> <laughs> anyway, thank you very much. <laughs> thank, you, thank you very much for staying fantastic for three months, Frost Lord Army. Absolutely glorious. Three quarters of a beaver pregnancy. Yeah, I mean, just we're just running and raving. I'm not really salty as fuck when I'm running and raving. I'm just running and raving. Doesn't mean anything, does it? He put two silent eyes in his name. <laughs> Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. <laughs> oh yay, I've got my second beaver. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Oh. Yep. There you go. Exactly. It's just it's just to see him says two two beasts beside the line. If he was three, he'd have been safe. Because even if I got the uphill, I would have had no recovery. But he gave himself. He he his positioning allowed for the chance of the three and eight scatter. And obviously, it was a really lucky scatter. You know, so it was really lucky to get the double pow. Uh, one in four, wasn't it? One in four to get the double pow. Uh, but specifically the double power was harder um, so it was like a one in nine to get the to get the double power and then a three in eight to get the scatter the scatter and then a one in three to get the scatter go that way and it was a long scatter so it was it was outrageously lucky however if he'd been three in there would have been no chance of it Deagle. <laughs> I'm not whining a lot, but I did get really lucky on that. I mean, to be fair, my guy did get killed after doing it. My my dancer paid for that ball sack with his life. And I don't know why I've got wrestlers on the LOS, just so they can get cast, I guess. Yeah, it was a bit careless. Like it was, he shouldn't have been punished with the touchdown, but it was a bit careless from him. Sure. <laughs> Dick. <laughs> right, how far away is this bastard? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So the, 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 we've got we've got three potential scorers. You've got four potential scorers. I really should have done a normal setup, right? Um, I just kind of forgot. <laughs> I guess I could go for the counter score. He's pretty open to the counter score, isn't he, actually? Very open to the counter score now. He's got to re-roll this. Lucky bastard. Lucky bastard. He was so open to it. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. GFI, GFI. 
That was lucky, wasn't it? He, he done goofed there, I think. Right, need the pal here. Yeah, boy. Right, let, let's base him first. <laughs> what about going this way? No. So going this way gives us the, the 1D at the moment. Yeah, I'm going to go for it. Go there, or could go. <laughs> this way. <laughs> I haven't no Hancock, no. <laughs> Glorious self bullshit. God, elves can be good, can't they? <laughs> Thanks, Frost Lord Army. <laughs> Yeah, very good. <laughs> very good, Skuro. Yeah, that was maybe a bit tilted, wasn't it? It was totally unprotected. And then he realised it was totally unprotected and uh had to Hello Incesticide. That's a great name, I think, Incesticide. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> Maybe it could be Hancock. <laughs> My friend, I have a friend who wanted to be an escort. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, by the way, Otro, thank you very much for staying fantastic for two whole wheel friends. I don't know if I, uh, I don't know if I, made, you know, glossed over it because I was thinking or not. But thank you very much. And, um, yeah, I can't remember, he, he fucking thought of a name for himself, it was hilarious. He thought of a fucking name for himself and I can't remember it. It was a proper hilarious name. These fucking chaff dodgers. Hey. Aren't good enough. <laughs> Oh, shit. oh fuck off man, I've sucked the ball twice and both times it's cost me a fucking war dancer's life. <laughs> I mean to be fair I didn't need to follow there, if I hadn't followed, I hit him from here right, so if I hadn't followed I could have just handed it off to the dancer and that would have maybe been better. But. Also, I wanted it more chance of ca get, catching it off the scatter and making it harder for him to catch the scatter. But I guess seeing as he already had two tackle zones on him, he was already going to catch it on like a six. <laughs> two costly sacks, aren't they? Holy shit. But two in love, which is pretty good. <laughs> 
Just got to get a quick score in and go 3 0 up, and then it should be pretty hard for him to get the draw. <laughs> Beaver Matt's the best thing about this dream, thanks. I can't remember his fucking name that he called himself. Fuck, man. Oh, that was hilarious. <laughs> yeah, J5, it's looking all right now, isn't it? Because I was lucky. <laughs> it wasn't Brock Table Leg. No, no. It was like, it was a name that he thought was cool. <laughs> That's what made it so hilarious. <laughs> um, it is a Res League, yeah, TLC. <laughs> It was just, it was just some stupid fucking name. It was just some stupid name that like a child would have thought of, that a child would think was cool. That's what it was. It was fucking hilarious. <laughs> Penetrating games. <laughs> God. <laughs> Speaking of penetrating games, <laughs> I had a really fucking, I really had a really fucking weird dream last night, by the way, which I'm sure you're itching to know about, so I'm going to tell you about. Um, I had an incredible dream, and what happened in my dream was, uh, there were some aliens taken over the earth uh, and <laughs> the aliens like oh god it was so weird but you know it was just it was just good that I can't be bothered to tell you it because it no one wants to fucking know some dickheads dreams do they but it was fucking funny <laughs> Right, we'll go over here just in with the obligatory what if there's a what if there's a blitz. Well do you know what? In fact put it swap them around so if there's a if there's a kick over here, the thrower can pass it, and if it's back here you can just get it and hand it off. That's probably better, isn't it? I'm sure it was a it was a dream, yeah. One day I dreamt that I was dreaming and then I woke up and I was still dreaming and I had another dream that I was dreaming. Well done, Tree. You got a push. Fuck me. Si le joueur trébuchant du terrain, il finira dans les tribunes. Et connaissant les fans de Blood Bowl, ce serait une très mauvaise idée pour lui. I've got no fucking players. I just realised. Really needed a power there on that blitz, didn't I? <laughs> oh god. Uh, they got cast TLC. Both times I I sacked the ball, my dancers were cast in return. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, mark yourself for a great tip, yeah. Um, yeah, and no, I just realised people don't want to fucking hear about dreams. It didn't even happen, did they? They're just... Uh, but it's weird, I can often remember them. I feel like writing them down sometimes so that um, I can, like... Because they're, they're, they'd be kind, they're kind of decent stories a lot of the time. 
fuck me. I don't have a dream journal, but I was thinking about it, because honestly, I have some fucking funny old dreams. They're pretty good tales. Double one, go on. Yes! <laughs> wow, I think now he's getting to the point where he can say he's diced, isn't he? I mean, if it wasn't, if there was, if there was any doubt before, I think that doubt is now gone, right? There's another one. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> just, I don't know if it was funny, this. It was just fucking weird, man. It was just fucking weird. I dreamt that. Uh... <laughs> right, this is this is what it is. I'll tell you the story that I dreamt. Um. I got a message through the post that there was a thing happening in um, in York, and I should go to York with my dad. <laughs> right? So, so me and my dad went to York, this place in York, and then we get there, and it's like a library, uh, some library or something, and then there's a there's like a there's a room with about 30 people in and it's a, it's a bit like they live right because we put on these we put on these glasses <laughs> and all of a sudden they're all fucking crazy aliens like fucking fly heads tentacles coming out of their heads fucking all sorts of crazy fucked up aliens right loads of different varieties of aliens but the thing is as soon as we put on the glasses we see them and we're like holy shit and then they just all turn around and look at us and we're like fuck <laughs> <laughs> and then, so we get up and run out and then as we're running out some of the aliens are good aliens and they're fighting the bad aliens <laughs> as we make our escape right. and then uh, <laughs> and then we get to, we get to the door there's a door that and like this is kind of to safety for some reason right and um, <laughs> just come in peace um, and then we get the door, right? And then I'm like, we, we, we've got to wait for me dad. And then, um, I'm like, we've got to wait for me dad. And then he, this guy says, now nah, he's gone for a kebab. <laughs> so I'm like, all right then, let's board, let's board the door shut. So we board the door shut so they can't follow us. <laughs> and, then, um, and then we get out, right? And then I see... There's this, uh, there's this, there's this kid who went to my school, right? And he was about, he was about five foot tall and black. I mean, not that that's relevant, but he was. And uh, and I saw him, and he was on like a headset, and I thought he's on, he's an alien, he's a fucking alien. So um, so we're we're going out, and I'm like, that, that, that one, he's a fucking alien, and then uh. And then this guy goes for him, but the guy who's gone for him is the alien, and he isn't an alien. So, <laughs> so then I uh, I go for the guy who's going for him, and uh, stab him or something. I don't know exactly what I do, but he's like he's fucked up a bit, um, and he's kind of dying, right? And he said. And then he goes, I might, I might die, but I'm going to take your eyes. And then he fucking sent these tentacles out. And the tentacles were going fucking chasing me. And like, they're getting close to my eyes. And I'm like putting my hands in the way. And then it's going towards my eyes again. And I'm fucking shitting myself. And, uh, and these fucking tendrils are coming towards me and that. And then someone kills him just, just before they get to me. So I was happy. Um... The tentacles weren't penis shaped, no, they were they had like little like kind of knives on the end, in fact. Uh, so there you go. And yeah, that was so that was that was that. And then um and then what happened was we we got away from all this anyway. 
then, and then we went to America. And then there's the same kind of deal in America, right? We're in America now. And we're sat in this we're sat in this big like meeting hall type thing, right? And it's like for some reason I don't know why, I don't know why I'm there. But I'm there, Scarlett Johansson's there, um, Chris Evans is there, uh, Chris Hemsworth there, and The Rock is there, right? <laughs> We're all sat there. <laughs> and then, um... <laughs> yeah, yeah, standard meeting, right? <laughs> standard meeting. And so, like, I'm just thinking they're celebrities, right? I'm just thinking they're celebrities. So, um, then what happens is, then it gets a bit weird. Um, and I can't really share the details on Twitch. But there's there's things happen that are a bit weird. <laughs> and naughty. <laughs> so I can't really mention them. So, after all this happens... What eventually, what is essentially the gist of it is, I, I fucking stamp on a dog, and that's how it ends, which births the Antichrist. And then <laughs> the Antichrist comes out, and all of the buildings start falling down and stuff. Everything's on fire, right? And it turns out that it isn't Chris Hemsworth, it isn't Scarlett Johansson, and it isn't Chris Evans, it's actually Captain America, Thor, and Black Widow, and they were undercover as celebrities. They are actually... <laughs> they were actually um, the real Avengers, right? And but the Rock was just the Rock, and <laughs> the Rock. Well, there was other things that happened before that, which I can't really talk about. But like, there was human sacrifices and uh, all sorts of weird things happened before that. But the the, the kicker was me stamping on the dog, right? <laughs> And then, but the rock's just the rock, right? And then his dad's there, but the dad isn't his real dad because obviously his real dad died. Um, um, so his his dad was getting played by the fat guy, the fat the fat black guy in Die Hard was playing the rock's dad. <laughs> Die Hard, the copper, who, 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 the, the, the feel-good ending of the story is him killing a man. Is he? <laughs> that one! That one! He's playing The Rock's dad! How funny is that? He looks vaguely like him, doesn't he? <laughs> um, oh, I meant to click off there. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so yeah, so he was he was the rock star, and he's like, I gotta find my boy. <laughs> and and uh, it turns out that the rock was in this building. Um, that like you know collapsed or something. So, um, no, no, he's in the building. I said, look, he's, he's, it's fine. He's, he's safe. He's in that building. He's fine. And then the building collapses. <laughs> he's like, oh, my God. And I'm like, he'll be fine. He's the rock. Don't worry about it. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> and uh, but he is worried about it. So he goes to a... Uh, <laughs> He goes to go and get it. Um, so he's like, he's trying to run it, and me and me and somebody's like holding him back from going in to to rescue him. But eventually, he goes in and he tries to rescue him. And what's happening is there's there's like in in the rubble, there's like a reception, and it's like you know like a nightclub. They're letting somebody in to go downstairs for everyone who comes out. And I'm like, he's like, I've got to go in there and get him. And I said, just wait. If they're letting people out, they'll let him out, won't they? So just wait, and he'll come out. If you go in there, then you might it might take ages for you to go out. And uh, he's like, no, I'm going in. And then I saw that they're fucking coming out as zombies. 
They're fucking zombies, they're coming out. So it's like, holy shit. And then, so I, I, I send this message to him to try and get to him, because he can't hear me. And then he, he looks at it and he sees it and he comes up at the top and he's like, all right, we've got to kill them. And then he, he helps me fight off these zombies for a bit. And then, uh, and then we escape. And then that, then it ends, then I, then I woke up. <laughs> the Toyota Hilux. So there you go. <laughs> yeah, I know it was it. It was just a dream, incestor say. It's not a movie. It was just a dream. It's just literally what I dreamt. <laughs> it was a clusterfuck. <laughs> He's still alive. Glorious. Yeah, it sounded all right, didn't it? It wasn't too bad. It, it, I think, you know, you could refine it and make it into, like, a movie. I have, I have a few dreams like that where it, it could be something. Hello, Ruzzer Who. Um, I don't know. I think Chops are the best for CCO. <laughs> Men in Black 5. <laughs> there, there's a bit of a part. There was a bit of a porno halfway through. <laughs> to be honest, <laughs> that was the bit that I couldn't uh, talk about. There was a bit. There was a porno halfway through, yeah. <laughs> right. So what do you blitz him? No, we can't. Yeah, we can. Block him first. Easy. And we blitz him. Why is that a one day? Oh, because I haven't got an assist. So assist him. Block him. Perfect. Si le joueur trébuchant du terrain, il finira dans les tribunes. Et connaissant les fans de Blood Bowl, ce serait une très mauvaise idée pour lui. Fuck. Well, flip me, guys. That isn't what I wanted at all. Alright, that works. Instant bloody one! <laughs> Tricky, this isn't it? He could get uh, to the. He could make it three three here, couldn't he? Ha <laughs> 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 Fucking hell, <laughs> slaps. <laughs> yeah, obviously, plus strength's great if you get block later. Um, but block's really good, isn't it? Et connaissant les fans de Blood Bowl, ce serait une très mauvaise idée pour lui. <laughs> oh, dear, dear, fine. <laughs> Flip me, J5. Uh, the injuries don't matter, Rosie Who, because it's it's res. So the only issue is uh, not not getting a draw. These dodges have been unreal for him, hasn't he? He hasn't failed one. He hasn't failed one fucking dodge. I go, okay, he's used rerolls on them, but still. I 
need to clear all of these to be able to dodge him out on a two. No, I just needed to clear him. So actually, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, so we can have a guy there, he can get to here. I fucking record it up. Fucking one. <laughs> oh man, so unlucky. Maybe I should have got him there so I'd have someone. <laughs> if he scores this turn, he's still got a chance, hasn't he? <laughs> I'm a little bit unlucky. I mean, it's fair enough, obviously. He's <laughs> I've been really lucky with the two scores. <laughs> Well, that wasn't too crazy to get out of that. <laughs> Brilliant kill there, <laughs> Was I just shouting, Bessel? <laughs> yeah, I just need to stop him scoring two touchdowns, don't I? So that's why I thought, just run back and make it hard for him to get this ball. Because if that, you know, two two pluses and then it's hard for him to get the ball. And then with if that guy had made the two dodges, then that makes it super hard for him to get the ball. Basically impossible for him to get the ball from the turn. And then, so that was essentially like four two pluses to make it easy, make it a win with four two pluses. Um, and getting through wasn't easy. If he'd left it easier to break through the, the earlier turn, I would have gone for the breakthrough score to make it four one, but it wasn't easy with so few players. <laughs> Is he going to geofight to hit with tackle? Or 3D with nothing? I guess he geofies to hit with tackle. No, he's not. He's just geofied. Oh, it would have been a double geofied. Oh, he's got block. Oh, fair enough. I didn't realize that one. It's the block one. It's a shame because if I if I'd put it, this guy up there, that would have obviously been harder. Um, but I thought it's just a, it's just two pluses to make it a lot harder. Like if this guy had been there, this this just doesn't happen really, does it? He's he's got to try for the score this turn. He does have to try for the score this turn, I think. Not sure about this GFI. I think that was maybe the interface uh, getting to him. Yeah, it's a decent scatter because he has got to go for the touchdown this turn. Bastard. Intercept? No. It's going to square. Hey, good. Good, 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 good. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five. Bob. 
Ils ont subtilisé le ballon et à la part de l'adversaire. Impressionnant. C'est une passe de la dernière chance. Oui. <rire> Really could have made that. He had a chance of the three three, didn't he? Despite me going, <laughs> despite me going three nil up. <laughs> well, did do well to make it close, didn't he? Because it was, uh... <laughs> you know, he said it himself. He fucked up a bit by making it two. He did make a mistake two away. And he, he did make a mistake pushing for the equaliser, really, I think. Uh, oh, maybe I should have gone an extra square last turn. But you don't want to do the GFI before you pick up the ball, do you? That's the thing. There's still a chance if he scores this turn, right? He could get a blitz or a riot. So there's still a chance if he scores this turn. Just doing some testing, Basil. Basley. B E Z L E. B E Z L E E. Basil. Hello, folks. Hello. Basil. I play on Xbox. Oh no. <laughs> 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 From my testing, I have concluded. Bezel, 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 In case you don't know what's going on there, when we were playing uh, GTA together, Fault Force and BZL and myself and Just Joe, um, <laughs> decided we decided to, uh, for some reason, to just start shouting bezel. <laughs> there you go. That's, that's, that's about as, as in-depth as the story gets. <laughs> And it was entirely too amusing for what it was. <laughs> like, it was hilarious. <laughs> but it was a definitely had to be that kind of thing. But all. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, Sam Fields. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, his coach name is Basil, isn't it, on Blood Bowl 2? I'm pretty sure. Turn right. Ah, oh, they I guess Kaz are a tiebreaker. He's going to run away and punch. Most reliable guys, the uh, tree now, isn't he? It was a great game from the tree, didn't he? Like, did nothing. There's no, no need for a pass. I needed everyone. I needed these to get away because they were strength two. You two. <sighs> he should make a hit, right? To to get because Kaz difference could be a could be a thing. Yeah, yeah, it's a good idea, sort of field, yeah, maybe I should have thought of that. I mean, I don't know, I could still just outrun him, though, even if it was close to him. If it was a t Oh, yeah, but then it's a touchback, and then he gets the blitz, yeah, it could have been a touchback and a blitz, yeah. Oh, that's a good point. Very good point. Yeah, I thought he would have had to break through my lines to get to the ball, but yeah, no, it's a good, good, good thinking from sort of field. Very good. Um, right, 13 heavy breaks to one. Um... <laughs> and made a, made a decent amount of blocks to be fair there. GFIs were pretty decent. Catchers, dodges were pretty decent because a few were three pluses. Pickups were good. Passes were good. Take routes were good. Stand ups, not so good. <laughs> and the leap happened, and obviously the uphill block and the scatter were the big things. 15, 17, 18, loads of pals. He got 20, 25, 23, so he, he was not terrible dice. His dodges were pretty good because he never failed them because he was always failing the first one and making the reroll. Wow, how many GFIs did he make? 35. <laughs> That's probably more GFIs than he would have liked, right? Yeah, no, it is, it's right though. It's right, Sadafiel. So you, uh, you were spot on there. I think that's. I think that's a fair assessment. Um, things could have gone absolutely right for him, couldn't they? And that was. That was definitely so. Joint top of the league now. I mean, this shouldn't really be surprising because obviously every everyone in it's good, right? Paul's just been to the final of uh, CCL. Calcium, obviously, we know Calcium. Throw X, a big guy in fumble. Um, Shawnee, obviously, really good. Good time, I've heard of him, I think he's good. <laughs> see bro beat me and I'm sure I'm pretty sure he's recognised as being good. And obviously just to see him. So two zero. I wish I hadn't lost to C Bro really, that was the thing. That was I could have maybe drawn that, maybe, if I'd played better, I'm not sure. I do I do feel like I was a bit diced, but I definitely had diced <laughs> I diced calcium with a one in twelve nine six. Then, uh, and then I dice just to see him with a cage Scott dive. Like well, with, with the one cage dive, the second cage that, dive was eh? a result of the first, really, wasn't it? Um, and it was kind of more his mistake, really, the second one. 
And the first one was still his mistake if he'd been three. If he'd been three in from the sideline, he'd been all right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.